Hi, chat. Hello. Can you hear me? Ladies and gentlemen. Programs and users, it's Monday. Little bit of a slower start, but uh, you know, uh, what the hell? Come on, camera. Are you kidding me? I had you working, you son of a bitch. Give me a moment. Wait for it. There it is. Hi. <laughs> Camera's like, yo, uh, nope. Camera did the old nope. Not today. Not today, Satan. There we go. Hey. Uh, wow, that is a little close. Let's, uh, let's zoom that out just a smidge, shall we? There we go. Hi. Hi. Damn camera. Yeah, I know. Uh, so I figured out what the problem was. Uh, oh, wow. What, you are just drifting all over the damn place today, ain't you? Number one, I need to get a new arm for this. Like, an actual proper mount, so... Whoa, 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 whoa. 50... Nobody should be working more than 40 hours a week, sir. 40. If you're working more than 40, you're doing it wrong. Sir, nobody works more than 40 hours a week anymore. If you need to work more than 40 hours a week to survive and pay your bills, holy shit, sir, you need a different job. Oh, okay, within two weeks it's different, okay. <laughs> That's different, okay, within two weeks, okay, all right. I was about to get real upset with you. What do you mean sleep, no, sleepy. Again, if you're working more than 40 hours a week, you're doing it wrong. Hi, chat. So, um, I don't know. Zool, are you still here? I don't know if she's still here. She might still be here. Who is it? What do you mean? Who is this? Who is this? Uh, I'm going to, okay, a couple of things. Number one, I am, hi, you're still here? I hope everything goes well. I know you said you have a meeting. Um, number two, how's your new office? Is it, are, are your, your office thing still working well for you? So, I, I spent some time with Zool over the weekend, uh, specifically yesterday and last night, and uh, it was, we got her s office situation sort of, sort of sorted out. We got it started. We got it started. So, it's, it's a usable space for her now, so. I played this game for a few hours last week, and I just want to say one thing, fuck bees. <laughs> My council told me not to show my office thing. Well, listen, <laughs> that's between you and your council, and I don't even want to know why you were showing your thing in the first in the office in the first place. Um, but yeah, uh, also, it sounds like, and I hope you guys are all right with this. And frankly, if you aren't, well, tough bananas, anyways, just gonna happen. Zool might be joining us a little more frequently. You know, in the future, so I hope you're prepared. You may notice. That's what council said, but but that ship has sailed, yeah. Me, I want against this tough bad guy, bees. I'ma fuck this guy's day up. That's Yep. 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 You take on five wolves, no problem. One group of bees instantly ends your day. <laughs> it's like Anyway, um, so I messed around a little bit over the weekend, uh, maybe a total of like 10, 15 minutes. You never go full my girl? Why not? Always go full my girl. <laughs> Always! Unless you're allergic to bees and fuck that shit. <laughs> Dude, a bee death. Bee, 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 bee. Um, by the way, uh, Zool, like I, I showed you the picture. I have the cable here. He was APA to death. I mean, you know what? Like, fuck those bees. <laughs> but yeah, so I have that cable. Um, you can feel free to pop by and pick that up for the, uh, for your dock at any point. And then that'll just, you know, everything's plugged into the dock and you can just swap between the work laptop and your gaming laptop. And then it's just one cable, one cable to connect them all, that USB-C from the dock into the freaking whichever laptop you're using, whether it's your work one or your, or your 
That blacksmith dude just standing there doing- Yeah, I know, right? Doing fuck all I'm- I mean, he just standing there. He taking up goddamn- He taking up precious goddamn space, isn't he? Any. Anyway. We're gonna be jumping back into Entrouded. Dad figured out, uh, the, the- the base building. So we're gonna do some building. No! No, not Slife. We're not running. Run. No. No, no. You're running. I'm not. <laughs> uh, so... Over the course of the next two weeks, because Siege of Warrison is going on in Star Citizen, we're going to be ta we're going to be spending our time on Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and in Shrouded. We are still going to be doing Tuesdays and Thursdays in Valheim. We have much to still do in that, and we are going to complete that one. So we are still going to be working with Valheim on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Just so you guys are aware. Um, something else to, of note is still yeah much to still do about nothing i mean listen it's fun and i enjoy it but also uh in the for the foreseeable future i am going to be putting taking the the twitch vods and archiving them over on youtube um, I'm just, it's one of those, I'll be just putting them through, uh, a, a bit of an audio filter just to clean the audio up a little bit better than, I mean, I know the audio on Twitch is pretty good, but I can do better. So I'm just, I've already got some presets in DaVinci that I've been using for a long time for, uh, for videos. So it's like, boom, I'm just going to throw them through there. Uh, just clean up the audio a little bit and then push them out to YouTube and, uh, it's just going to become... It's going to become fairly streamlined in the long run, but I figure that's probably the best bet. Anyway, how are you? How was your weekend? What games did you play? Did you play any Vigi games? I really do thoroughly love this. Um, also, you may notice uh, we, we have uh, there, right, 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 right there. We has we have the music thing working properly. Only I've gone back to using Spotify because I found. Um, so this 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 composer Alexander uh, Nakarada. Uh, he does royalty free music, generally in this folklore Celtic Nordic kind of vibe. This very kind of medieval vibe. Uh, so for the foreseeable future, when I'm playing stuff um, with, ex for example, Valheim or Entrated, we're going to be using his stuff. Uh, I think I'm going to be dropping the Pretzel Rocks uh, subscription. It's just, I'll be honest, uh, it's, it, while it is great that that service exists, it is awkward as fuck to use for searching. It's, yeah, exactly. It's not deep. It is not deep. It is in no way, shape, or form deep. And so I think uh, for the foreseeable future, I'm just going to dump that, save myself the, the uh, you know, the, the 12 bucks a month kind of thing, right? Wow, this song again. Well, the thing is, is though, there's like 1,300, like the one playlist I use when I'm doing um, Star Citizen, there's 1,300 songs on that playlist. But, I mean, it's, you know, there... Yeah, but for, yeah, but for, yeah, but for 12, yeah. Yeah, but 1,200 of mint is 100. Well, it's not that it's mint, it's just... I've got better, I have better options already existing on Spotify so, uh, for, for royalty-free, so... As long as I'm using... Uh, here's the thing. So I don't have to worry about it so much on Twitch, but I do have to make sure that when I'm posting the VODs over to YouTube that I am making sure that I, I credit um, the the playlist that I'm using or the, the in this case, the, uh, the composer, right? So um, that's something I have to become very much more aware of is uh, proper attribution and credit. Even though it is royalty free, there are expectations for you uh, royalty free music use that you do give proper attribution and credit to the author of that music, to the composer of that music. Anyway, moving forward. Uh, speaking of which, hold on, I haven't even checked. Let's. Uh, you know what? Oh look, there is an update. Okay, well I'm just gonna let it update. That doesn't mean we're playing. 
I love that. Start your adventure. Learn the ropes by enlisting an expert. No. <laughs> I don't need no goddamn, uh... I don't need no goddamn expert. Uh, so, something else. I'm gonna leave for now, but I'll be back a little bit later. Okay. I'm glad that the office space is working out for you, Zool. I'm very happy that that's working out, uh, and it's really comfy for you, so. Um... We'll just let this update for a minute. And again, baby steps, right? We got we got a little bit done, and yeah, that's right. It's only going to get better. Uh, so I'll let this do its thing. Don't worry, we're not. No, chat. I know it says Entrated. We're not playing Star Citizen. Don't worry, we are going to get into Entrated. I'm just waiting for Star Citizen to update. So, the whole situation with VKB and DHL. Guess what I found out over the weekend? I got my hands on an updated freaking list from DHL. You know what is on the list now? Tilsonburg, where I live, is now on that fucking list of remote areas. Even though I could drive from the drive to their depot in 25 minutes. Their local depot is a 25 minute fucking drive. And they want an additional $35 US. Yeah. So now what? I'm gonna, I, I don't know. I don't know. I think honestly, it's just DHL trying to, trying to take advantage because there is no need for an additional $35 USD charge. I figured it out yet last night. The additional fees just for shipping and handling and the duties that I would have to pay would amount to an additional $102. No, not for a hundred and two fucking extra dollars for shipping and handling? Oh fuck no, it's not worth it. Not worth it. Not worth $102 Canadian. I can't have stuff delivered to a private post office box, so. Hey, Postan, how are you doing? Unfortunately, like, it's not... The the uh, $35 a month to have... And, and having a post office box. How about a friend? A friend where? That's the point. My friends all live in small rural communities. <laughs> like... Toronto. Toronto. There are parts of Toronto... A metropolitan area with millions of people living on top of each other. There are parts of the city that were classified as remote areas to, to DHL. Parts of Toronto. Think about that. Millions of people. They have a central depot there at an internet at Pearson International Airport. And there are parts of that city that were put onto the freaking. Yeah, how the hell remote? Exactly. No, it, it has nothing to do with that. It's fucking random and it's bullshit. I don't stand. I will not. Full stop. Will not deal with anybody who ships with DHL. I'm, I just won't. Because as far as I'm concerned, DHL at this point is just running a fucking scam. They're running a fucking game. There is no reason to use them. None. Now there are plenty of options. It's some some of these some of these uh, some of these businesses choose not to use the other options. And that is on them. But so is UPS, so is FedEx, so is Purelator, so are post offices. There are a bunch of other like uh, Asiata. There there are a ton, right? So what do you, what? I don't know. Uh, I'm going to look at, I'll look at FedEx and see what they offer because FedEx, we have UPS here, right? It's that time of the month again, Jaffa, 1980, thank you so much, 38 months. Jaffa, how are you doing? But yeah, at this point, it's just, I don't know what to do now, right? Yeah, this is still about VKB, but more because DHL pull, is pulling some fast shady shit as far as I'm concerned as business. There is no, there are areas of Toronto. Again, a city with millions of people. There are parts of that city, city, 
that they have now claimed are remote areas, and they're not. Can't tell DHL to hold at the center and pick it up. Nope. DHL will not, will not. DHL won't, won't do the hold at center and you pick it up later. Unfortunately. Already looked into that as an option too, so. Um, right. Anyway. Not a big deal. It's just now I'm going to have to uh, come up with something, something different. That's all. Going to have to come up with something different. Um, you know what? Let's. It is what it, I mean, it, it just, all it does is just complicates things. That's all. Unnecessarily complicates things. But complicated nonetheless. Uh, we're going to throw that up there. Okay. It is what it is. Well, I'll figure it out. Just for the time being, I'm just going to have to... Okay, fixed. Yep. Yeah. Uh, we don't... Rough stone, rough wood, plant fiber roof block. It is what it is. Like I said, it is what it is. Uh, wooden door. We have three different wooden doors. There's the basic. There's that one. Okay, wooden door. Uh, windows. I need one more window. No, you listen. Hi, Canadian Gamer. Hey, uh, Canadian Gamer. I can get a box anywhere. Oh, God. You dick. Get off my freaking lawn, bastard. Hey, um, Gamer. Uh, thanks for shooting me that quick message yesterday. I do appreciate that. I kind of, I had a feeling that YouTube was just... It was just YouTube being YouTube, doing slow ass shit. Unfortunately. Um, luckily it's, you know, it, it seems to be resolved now. Uh, wait, what? No slot, oh, it's because there's no slot available. All right, um. Do, 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 do. I already have a door. Mm. Oh, okay, let's let's do the double door. Let's do the double door, chat. Actually, hold on. We're gonna do that right there. Okay. Uh. No, that's way too goddamn. Ah, hell no. Nope. Nope. Okay, let's try that one instead. That's a little freaking closer to normal. Right. Okay. I've done that a couple of times. Just want to... Yeah, no, 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 it wasn't a mistake on my part. They finally got it, like, it finally got, um, done. So I was like, all right, there we go. Um, yeah, we're gonna do the rough wood. Uh, by the way, how'd your, uh, flight gear setup go? All right, so like I said, I figured out how to get the, like, how to do the, the building in this. Uh, on, uh, I want to say it was Saturday night? Saturday night. So yeah, it was Saturday night. I figured out how to get the, how to get the building. Now, we're doing this block by block, because I just kind of, there's something about just, like, doing individual blocks that I just rather, I don't know, I, I seem to really enjoy. Haven't done it yet. This thing's got busy. Oh, that no. You know what? That happens. I understand that. I totally get that. I totally understand that. So, 
You guys might be wondering, like, why in the hell is he going through it like this? Well, because, you know, reasons, okay? I don't want to hear none of this at me bullshit. Okay, don't, don't you, don't you dare at me. Don't you dare at me. Yeah, I know YouTube can sometimes be a little snarky, especially uh, considering like it was it was a VOD, right? And VODs tend to be, you know, fairly chunky. So this this scaffolding is only here temporarily. I will be getting rid of it ev eventually. Um. Uh, okay, no, that that is that is exactly how we need it. All right. There's something there. There's something about doing the single block. The problem is, is I want to do the two meter, but the issue with the two meter is it gets a little finicky. Um, okay, so. You know what, well, uh, come on. So we're gonna, we're gonna, the whole idea here right now is to just sort of get a spot built first and then we'll, uh, we'll, we'll move on from there. We'll, because I need the I need the space kind of built first so I can remember we've already got the blacksmith so the idea is to get this all built up I like get some stuff here first because we already have the blacksmith just reviewed the VOD and now it can be viewed yeah up to 1440 yeah yeah so it was I get the, the one thing I learned was that it seems odd to upscale a 1080p VOD to 1440. Hmm. But the funny thing is, is it actually, um, when you do the upscale properly, um, and you, even if you watch it at, at 1080p, it still ends up looking fine. It, it's kind of weird. It's a little messed up. I don't fully understand. It has something to do with the way uh, YouTube does their uh, their their encoding or some some nonsense. Uh, we're gonna do that. Yeah. Okay. All right. Beautiful. Um. Let's do. All right. Okay. Um. And alt. And I want five. There we go. Okay. Uh, pardon me, sir. There we go. Really? Oh, you're going to be a complete donut about it, are you? Awesome. Love it. Aha. You better not have cut into the door. Oh, you mother trucker. You mother trucker. Like, I don't mind the fact that, you know, we get access to VP9 and things like that, but it is a little bit of a... Oh, come on. Like, really? All right. You, you are just going to 100% just be a pain in my ass, aren't you? All right, well, we'll do this then. When in doubt. Aha! Yes! Oh, you absolute beaut. Oh, 
Okay, I know why. That, that, and you know what? That's, that's absolutely fine. Oh, you absolute beauty. Uh, sometimes. <laughs> uh, whoa, 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 sir. Fucking sir. Um, how do I remove, ah, you snapping, there we go. Right, sir. What on earth is happening here? Sweet Jesus. All right, uh, let's go. Really? Sir. There we go. Okay, we're going to do that. We'll do that. Apparently, it's going to be a bit of a donut. So we're just going to help it not be a donut. Sound good? All right. Glad we had this chat, chat. Excuse me. Uh-huh. There we go. That's a little bit better. Oh, you mother truck. And you know what? That's fine. Whatever. Whatever. I can work with that. Okay. All right. Yeah. Looking looking pretty good so far. Hey, try to get my buddy to buy this game on the weekend, but he says it's not MMO, but only invited co-op. Yes. It is not an MMO. It is co-op and it is invited. Yes. You can actually do public as well, but it is only co-op. There it is not an MMO. It is an RPG, but not a massively multiplayer online. It is a co-op RPG. Nope, Valheim is not an MMO. Valheim is again, it is it is a uh, it is a Norse mythological survival game with RPG elements, but it is also per yeah. But again, Valheim is co-op. Yeah, yeah. MMO is massively multiplayer online, right? Whereas. Okay, are you really seriously kidding me with this? You son of a bitch. Okay, well, fine. Like I said, I kind of figured out the building. Not 100%, but I have it down a lot better than I did, so... I would take that as a win. So, let's just help it along a little bit, right? gonna help it along chat there we go okay it's 
So the one thing I don't like about the build system is just how it, it it's a little clunky, as you guys can see. Like it, it's not perfect. But again, I know that this is still like it is an early access title. There we go. Okay, now we're getting somewhere with it. Sort of. <laughs> All right, there we go. But yeah, so these are not like you can mod. Now, this game is not moddable, but um, the developers themselves have already stated that they're not against mods. The thing is, though, is because the game engine used for Shrouded is their own in-house engine that they developed for the game. It's not like there are readily available tools out there, right? Um, it's not like using Unity or Unreal Engine kind of thing, you know? Okay, nice. Hey, hey, that's actually looking pretty decent. I like it. By Jove, I think the man has it. Well, we got it. it's, it's, listen, it's getting there. Mem injected time, no hooks. Yeah, no hooks, mem injected time. Yeah, I, now, it's a door for short people that couldn't find that door size. I mean, listen, does... Really? Your dudes are average, like, six feet tall in this. So, I mean, that's a fairly good... You don't need, like, a gigantic freaking massive door. That's a go for it, we aren't helping statement. Not until it proves itself out. Well, again, with it being early access and the game is still in development, though... Uh, I think what it comes down to is they're not against it. It doesn't mean that there won't be tools in the future either. Uh, not necessarily that it's not on the roadmap. Yeah. Yeah, it's yeah, it, it's not that it's not on the roadmap. It's not important to them, right? And I totally understand that. I get it. I 100% get that. Um, ba -da -da -ba 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 uh, this isn't even version one though. We're not even in V1. That's that's the funny part. This isn't even V1. This isn't even V1. Uh, we have terrain. I don't have I don't have thatch roof okay so aha haha <laughs> you can jump through windows it's actually kind of cool okay um let's do actually do 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 Hold on. how many I have one two three 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 I need yeah, one, two, three. Three windows, okay. Excuse me. There we go. Okay. Windows are in. 
Hey! Callisto Protocol's on sale. That's fine. I still haven't even gotten to Fort Solace yet. Jesus. Sheesh. Um, let's do... Wait, okay, so we have some plant fiber blocks. Put any walls around you, work in areas so they don't attack you there. Also, no, I'm not worried about that yet. First, giving me the, the safe space for sleeping. The workspace will come, up and come after. You know what I mean? So I, you know what I mean. There we go. Uh... Okay, no, that's coming along all right. I get it. I got it. Am I okay? So the real question is still not classified as sheltered. Okay, you know what? That makes sense. It does make sense. about now now we're classified as sheltered okay sheltered warmth comfort level level eight Ooh! how much rest of bonus wow 13 minutes to level eight nice okay all right let's get us a wee bit of sleep here chat let's go Folks, if you're just joining us, welcome. I'm your host, Scott, the CRcade. Arcade. Happy Monday. Hope you had a good weekend. Thanks for joining us. We're checking out in Shrouded. Uh, this is our second day with it. Gotta say, I'm kind of enjoying in Shrouded a little bit. I'm, I'm liking this a little bit. I uh, figured now that I kind of... This survivor will be a worthy addition to our cause. Place him into the world with a summoning staff, which you can craft from simple twigs. Don't worry, we will do that after. Let me get my home finished first, goddammit. Sheesh. Let me finish my home, please. Goddamn. They're really on this. They're just like, yo, uh, I hope you understand uh, there's like uh, this this entire, you know, like. Right, so. Uh, let me get up onto our roof here. Have a quick look. There's something, okay, so there's just something about the way the end comes together I'm not a fan of, but meh. What? Not a big deal. It's not a big deal. Don't worry about it. We got a nice little basic, basic hovel going on here. I was like, why is this saying I'm not sheltered all of a sudden? I was about to get real upset with the game. I was like, uh, excuse me?
Yeah, see, two by two, that, that is not, nope. Uh, excuse me, sir, 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 sir. Okay, and we want nine. Holy shit. There we go. I'm like, mouse is being difficult again, chat. <laughs> My mouse is doing stupid things again. Okay. All right, all right, all right, all right. I can, I can work with this. All right, how are we doing for, uh, let's, how, how are we doing for materials here? I gotta get, you know what, can, you know what, we're just gonna delete that, okay? Just, that's all we're doing, we're just deleting it. Okay, we'll throw that in there. Definitely gonna need some more stuff. What have I got in the backpack that is like... Actually, no. I want that to be there. Oh. No. Right. Okay, we have resin. I have a little bit... Ah, okay. I'm just gonna leave that the way it is for now. It seems to be, yeah. So as soon as we're in, like totally in here now, it seems to work. So that's good. Uh, let's go back to one. No. One and there we go. Yeah. All right. Uh, sir, sir, thank you, thank you, thank you. That's kind of what I was going for. Right, okay, there we go. Yeah, buddy. Folks, if you're just joining us, hi. Are you having a good day? Do you know where your video games are? Do you know what games you're currently- what like what games is everyone currently into? Are you, are you playing? Have you gotten yourselves into this Meshuggah so far? Okay, I think. Wow, that is... Woo! Completely changes how the project function- wait, what? I'm going to need something strong to drink. Management decided last minute to make drastic changes to my project. Oh, ooh, yikes. Oh. That, yeah, that is a, a negative Ghost Rider. The fucking pattern is full bullshit. My brain just went, oh. There we go. Okay, I'd say we are now. Yep. Yep. Mmm, I love it. Look at this. 
Look at this. We figured it out, chat. We we decoded it. We decoded it. Uh, we're gonna throw all of that in. Uh, what else do I have here that I can get rid of? Uh, have a couple of those. We'll throw that in. Uh, what are these? Red mushroom? No. Nope. Um, we have twigs, which I can... I do have the shepherd's staff, which is nice. I'm deep into sim racing. So right now, ACC and iRacing is on my schedule most days. I get that. I mean, you guys know, I, I've kind of gone... I've stepped away, other than Star Citizen, stepped away from a lot of the, the sim stuff right now, but doesn't mean that it's gone. It just means for the time being, I'm, I'm kind of focusing my energies on, on other, other game titles for the time being. I'm just, uh, I'll be honest, I'm just having way more fun with a lot of this stuff, so it's like, okay, throw that in there. It comes down to uh, the variability in gameplay, right? Okay, we have two sparks. What is that? That is, oh, that's the heal channel. Okay. Um, do, do, do. Charcoal. We have some salt. We have animal furs. Okay. Uh, I guess the real trick is now. So I need to craft. All right, crafting, summoning staff, craft. Right, okay, um, let's do, we're gonna pick that up. And that is going to, a backpack. I'm going to throw that there for the time being. And we're going to do that. And that is going to go to good old number three. All that you cannot build it. Uh, don't tell me what I can't do, you son of a bitch. I can do whatever the hell I want. Not my dad. How dare you? How dare you tell me I can't build there? You're not my dad. the mans. Tell me what you need. All right. Forge, what do we need for the forge? Uh, we've got the stone. We need charcoal. All right, so that means we need the charcoal kiln first. Stone. Okay. Got it. What about nails? What do we need for the nails? Blacksmith metal scraps. I mean, they're all rectangular floor plans. Oh shit, I realized I made my base like yours. I nearly I be, built out evenly around the fire no house though yet. Yeah, so, um... Took you long enough to find me. Look at you, weak and puny. And they call you Flameborn. First thing you need is a weapon. Lucky you woke me up first. Crafting a scrappy sword or spike club will serve us well. All right, what about the cleansing fire? Ember Vale can still be saved. There's where there's ash, there's embers, kid. The shard suffocates the valley. So seek the elixir well with your new gear and raise the root of our misery. Ignore the depths and set this evil ablaze. Go on, I'm counting on you, Flameborn. Assembers! Ass embers, well rested. Okay, what do we got? Even with new gear, you shouldn't feel too safe out there. Rest up and eat well before you head out. A fire, a roof over your head, and some meat in your belly will prepare you for anything. 
Okay, nothing to discuss. Boom, done. There we go. Okay, so... At long last I return, I'm a humble blacksmith at your service. Let's prepare you for what's to come. Okay, well, here we go. We're gonna- we gotta commune with the thing. You've awakened your kin. The flame is pleased. So get more survivors slumbering in the springlands. Alright. Good to know. Diamonds forged in the mines of the prison pocket! I mean, listen. <laughs> Jesus. Holy crap. Um. Oh, hold on. Let me. Storage. If I want the small chest, what do I need? I need nails. Six of them. I have the logs. I don't have the nails. I need the nails. Right. Okay. So we're gonna get this man's crafting us some nails. Aye, there we go. Alright. Right, so, small chest. Yes, I have a small chest. 68 today, I'm calling it spring. Hydroponic tower cleaner ready to go. Let's go. What are you putting in the hydroponic tower this time, sir? What are you putting in the hydroponic tower? My phone won't stop. Good lord. All right, what do, how much space do we have? Damn, that is a lot more storage space. All right, let's go. Uh, we're gonna throw that in there. We're gonna throw the shepherd staff in there. Uh, we're gonna keep the arrows. Keeping them arrows. Don't need the sparks, so we'll put those down there. We need the torch, though. We'll leave that there. Um, root pieces. Yeah. Oh, okay. Um, so we'll throw gear there. That there. That is gear. We're going to throw the Metal Star Mace in there. Actually, no. I want the Metal Star there. There we go. That's better. Right. Okay, that goes with that. That is so much more storage space, chat. Holy crap. Um, right, we need to, actually, you know what, let's do that. That needs to get put, uh, yeah, I'll get food poisoning. We're not getting food poisoning this time around. Not gonna happen. Uh, so arrows. Much better. Okay. Um. Beautiful thing is, we can now do, uh, that one I'll leave for the time being. That's what I want. Okay. Want that. Excuse me. I want that and that. That, that, that. Nails. Okay. Okay, these are considerably better. Uh, we're gonna throw that and that in there, okay. Extra stone. Uh, actually, no, the stone and the wood I'm gonna leave for the time being, because I might need that. Uh, we are definitely putting that there, okay. Put that there. Um, ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba 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 -da -ba Dora, 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 the Explorer. Okay, we'll throw that there, that there, and that. There. Okay. Ruins. Actually that, and that. Okay, so. Looks better. Much better. All right, and what all do I have left in here? Uh, you know what? Let's grab that, that, and that. Um, 
Can I not? Okay, we're gonna pick that up. Tiny chest. My tiny chesticles. And we're gonna craft one more of those. Chat, I have a tiny chesticle. Dad has a tiny chesticle, chat. What do we do about this? Why? Edible walls, pick and come again. I can get <laughs> get. I can get salads for weeks, for weeks, months, on like two dollars. Damn, that's actual edible walls. I like that. Usually mix in some marigolds and keep it next to my uh, sal uh, saltiva. Sativa? Let's be cra Oh. The food court in my office has a hydroponic setup. They have it out front as a decoration piece, but also a food. That is actually kind of cool. Oh my, right? No man boobs. Feels okay. I mean, listen. Why are we, why are we, we're, we're not making fun of those that, you know, happen to have the, uh, the mansicles, right? Like, we're, we're not actually making fun of anyone for that, are we? We haven't ended up becoming those people at all, have we? I hope we haven't, because for the love of God. Okay, we're just gonna dump all of this extra goodness in here. And all right, yeah, we're gonna need that. We're gonna put the fireflies down there. We're gonna keep the nails in here. Uh, that I'm gonna delete. Should give me my material back. Looks to be the case, okay. Uh, we'll throw the twigs in there. Okay, so this is all crafting material, got it. And this is all the food stuff. All right. I can work with that. Much better. Um, oop, nope. No, that's a terrible idea. Wolf meat rot. No, god damn. Why would. No. No, 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 no. Wolf meat rod. Terrible name. Salvia. Oh, sativa is. We uh, listen. You know what? Uh, listen. Why? 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 Why are we making? It's not that important. <laughs> He's like it's sativa is a weed. Uh, is weed? I don't. I don't know what the hell. Okay. Yep. And three. Chug a lug. Let's go. All right. What? Don't make me tell you again. Clear that out. You just shut your hole and wait for me, okay? You old bastard. I'll get there when I get there. Fucker. God damn. Man, he's real bitchy. This man's over here. Just let me listen. We're 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 building a base first, okay? Don't invoke the weed nerds. You know what? I don't care. If you're a weed nerd, I don't care. If I hurt your feelings, tough. Get over it. <laughs> tough beans. Gotta protect it, dry it, fight mold, fight theft if it's visible. Not theft. How dare they? How dare they? How dare they steal the weeds? Out there, Sigga weeds. If you have feelings over weed, then pass that shit. Yeah, right? Puff, puff, pass. Pass to the left. Pass to the left. Pass to the left. Uh, I will gladly. Listen, I will take all the fur. I mean, I didn't kill you, but I will take advantage of the fact that you are already there and ready for harvest. Done and dusted. Let's go. 
Don't worry, we're gonna get we're gonna get killing. Weed isn't legal in my state, and locals are trying to ban gummies and THC. Even though science is uh, like medicine is already showing that there is a huge benefit to it. Listen, my place is cute as fuck. Look at this. Look at this place. That is cute AF, okay? I don't care what you say. I like my log cabin. It's cute. No fun. Yeah, apparently. No fun a lot in Kansas. Yeah, well. Y'all Kansans got to get together and talk about that shit. It's not bad. Cute. No, listen. Wouldn't be a word for it. It's cute. It's fine. It's cute. There's nothing wrong. What the hell's wrong with the word cute? Huh? Why can't a cabin be cute? Even if you're a grown ass man, there's nothing wrong with the word cute. You use it for all sorts of things. I, I, listen, I think old Canadian gamer is, 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 he's, listen. Sir. You need to stop being so grumpy. Don't be so crusty, you old curmudgeon. How dare you? How dare you, sir? Man's an old curmudgeon. He just like, no F's given, just no. I'm a grown ass man, nothing's cute. Men don't say the word cute. Bullshit. <laughs> AKA racist? Wait, what? Kansas is cheap to live in, but effing hell, you're living like it's 1959. I mean, that's... I don't know what to tell you there. I don't know what to tell you there. That, that is just... Hey, 1959 was a good year, I think. Tons 95%. Did <laughs> take a while, I guess. I like that racist. <laughs> oh, shit. All right, let's uh, let's get us some dag gum trees. Ah, uh, yeah. So I figured out that the axe that I had been using for wood is not good for cutting wood. Not good for cutting wood, okay? But as you can see, uh, figure that out. <laughs> now, we totally don't have people driving around with rebel flags hanging off the back of their trucks and cars painted from front to back with the official flag of the CSA. What? Wow, that uh, uh, that's a statement. I'm really not sure if I, 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 I don't feel comfortable about that. I'm like, sheesh. My kitchen was three years. <laughs> oh my lord. Resin, that's what I was looking for. Resin, there we go, there we go. I gotta keep my eyes open for that. Resin. Resin is kind of an important, uh, an important thing that I've been missing out on, as you guys can see. Baby shark lasted longer than the Confederacy. I could go on, barely scratch the surface of the stupid here. It's weapons grade. Wow. Not gonna lie, that that is actually terrifying. There we go, resin. Yeah, buddy. Woo, look at. Okay, twigs. Any more? Excuse me, sir. Sir, sir. Would like? I like more resin, sir. Please, sir. Can I have some more? Try living in Arizona. I mean, 
<laughs> Arizona is where where they retire to. <laughs> I don't. Isn't Arizona full of preppers? <laughs> I don't try. I avoid everything else. I don't know, like, I, I just, for me, I'm just like, holy crap, you know, like, it just, it freaking, it just blows my mind. But that being said, like, <laughs> it's not much different where I live in Canada, okay? It is unfortunate, but it is true. Okay, can I cut this down and take the material? Has this thing become... It's become indestructible, hasn't it? Okay, you know what? We're just gonna pick that up. Okay, I don't need that. We are gonna come in here and Dad is going to delete it. Thank you. Okay, perfect. Ooh. What is that? Elixir. Consumable. Elixir buff. Plus 30% damage. Minus one. Ooh. I don't like that at all. Uh, we're just gonna... We're gonna delete those. We don't need the berries. Berry, berries are inconsequential right now. Don't need the berries, chat. We don't need them damn berries. I love that. Did you forget about your weaponry? I'm waiting. You need to be able to fight back. It's a frightening world out there. Listen, you need to just shut your pie hole for now, okay? I'm busy. This man's over here, interrupting all my fun. Sheesh. We are definitely gonna need some light though, shortly. Okay, we've got plenty of stone. All right, so let's go here because I need that. Thank you. So we're just gonna we're just gonna build a little bit of a protective ridge here that things can't just jump over. You know what I mean? You know what I mean, chat? Does that make sense? Just gonna sort of wall this in a little bit, you know. Keep our uh, keep 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 our certain. Uh, I mean, we're gonna probably have to double up on that a little bit, but that's fine. Not a big deal. Oh, shit. You guys might notice we are kind of doing this one at a time. Ah, god damn it. <laughs> like shit. Alright, so the whole idea here is just to sort of I don't need like a gigantic, massive freaking defensive parapet, but we do need something up. And this is, this is just the start, you know what I mean? Just enough to prevent things from just instantly coming in, easily defendable. We don't need some walled city.
You know what? Fine, whatever. Oh, there you go. You said I racing. Oh, you done did it to yourself this time. You mentioned I racing. All right. Trying to make the Knoxville Nationals in September on iRacing special event, so I'm doing the dirt oval racing. Nice. So here's a question, old Canadian gamer. Why do you choose um, a set of Corsa Competizione for the GT3 rather than uh, iRacing? Just, just purely out of curiosity. You know what I mean? Um, okay, let's... That's where I started and I find the ACC is much more detailed in the aspects of that series. You know what? That's, that's fair. Like, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna be the, the person who sits here and says, oh, well, you're wrong for believing that or whatever else, because that's not, that's not how we roll around these parts. All right, you know what? Uh, resin, resin, resin. Don't see the resin there. No, do not. Okay, so we'll, I have resin in here. I don't, but we do now. And we'll throw the sticks in. Okay. Okay, right. Um, yeah. Okay, so 20 stone for the kiln. And weapon, spike club, scrappy sword, huh? Wood logs, metal scraps, nails. Level five, huh? Spectral shield. Metal sheets, bone meal, and charcoal. Okay, so we need, we gotta have the forge and the charcoal kiln built. So, ah, do 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 do. Right, so what do I need for that? Stone metal scraps, so I need 10 metal scraps. I need the char- So I need charcoal for that. So the first thing to do is we'll get the kiln built first. Let's get the, uh, let's get the kiln. So all we need for that is stone. Not here, next one. There we go. Stone. All right, we're going to do two. Yes, that is it. Woo! Oh, no, no, four. Not enough free space, okay. Okay, place items from your inventory here to make them available for the factory. Here you can track the production process. The factory will produce the selected recipe until no ingredients are left or factory's inventory is full. Switch between the recipes you have unlocked for this factory here. Browse recipes. So we have charcoal, wood acid, and tar. Oh my God. So I need wood logs and dirt. Got it. Okay, well that's selected. Uh, so I'll just throw the wood logs in there. So, stocking, so we need dirt. Chat, we need dirt. 
We're gonna need dirt, chat. Dirt. Like Joe Dirt. Throw all of that in there. We're gonna, uh, we'll throw that in there. Okay. That should empty us out. Okay, we're effectively emptied. Nice. I don't know how many kilometers my Volvo and ATS has 857,000 kilometers on it. Damn! Is it because your opponent is too attractive in that instant? Wait, what? I have a hard time trying to race myself. Ooh. Each sim has its own way of defining the physics and the ways of determining how the cars drive. There's no one better than the other. It's just different. No, and that, yeah. I mean, that's, there is that. But you don't get to race Frankie Muniz. Who in the hell is Frankie Muniz? Muniz. Muniz. Ah, Who, who's this man? Okay, so I need dirt, huh? Malcolm in the middle. Oh, right. Okay, that. There we go. Wait, what? And races. Wait, what? Seriously, I didn't know that. He owns. He funds his own team in Arca and race. I didn't even know that. That's actually kind of cool. Racing rumor is he may go to uh, Xfinity. Why would he go to Xfinity? I'm guessing money, obviously. I kind of, I got this figured out now how to get the dirt and so you've got, I don't know if you guys noticed, but there's actually a top layer, right? Which is good. This is, this is, this is actually fairly, a fairly realistic representation really when you think about it. Okay. Let's go three, five, six, done. Beautiful. All right. Perfect. So you have that that nice sort of like I figured I'd just dig the hole here, right? It was it just made sense. It's away from the base. I don't have to worry about shit. I'm gonna just dig the hole. There we go. Okay. Every time someone beats him or Max, they post they post it to Reddit or if Frankie rolls them happens. Oh, really? That's actually kind of funny. Wow, uh, we're going to need a lot more logs, aren't we? Shit. All right. Right, we're gonna just take the freaking logs and do this. Oh shit! <laughs> Whoops! There we go. Sixteen Q. Let's go. Let's get all that charcoal. Okay. Listen, sir. Just never mind. You shut your puppy pie hole over there. We ain't got nothing for it. we. I ain't got nothing to talk to you about right now. Okay. You just never mind. Gladder. Shroudwood. All right. So we're gonna need some shroudwood. Got it. All right. We're rested. Uh, let's not leave the door wide open. Sure. Actually, you know what? Hold on. Let's go in here for a quick second. Let's, let's boost this. 
Wonder how far you can dig down? I have no idea. I watched, actually, I, it's funny you ask that because I watched Tiger Rider in the group that he's been playing shrouded with um, dig up to get to a higher point. Like they dug a tunnel up on an angle to get to a high point to then jump and use their glider. It was kind of cool. It was very cool to watch. Um, so interesting little thing, and I'm gonna I'm gonna share this with you. I don't know if I shared this last week or not, but I'm gonna share it with you guys now. Uh, so if we can get up to 100 subscriptions or more per month and hold that for concurrent three months straight, I can actually get more from Twitch. I can actually get an increase. Uh, in the uh, in the revenue split, but I have to have 100 or more subscribers. Uh, so yeah, 100 or more subscribers for a uh, for a 90 day period, and it has to. And the, here's the thing, though, is out of those 100 subscribers, they have to be unique individual subscribers. Yeah, no, that was super. It was super clever. We're actually watching Tiger Rider and all of them. Nope, can't be gifted. Has to and can't be Prime either. Can't be gifted. Cannot be Prime. They have to be paid subscribers. But it has to be you in order to get the sixty forty split. It has to be. Uh, it has to be maintained at uh, one hundred individual unique subscribers. Um, for a 90 day period and then so here's the thing after that then it becomes a 60 40 split um, and that's good for an entire year and that 60 40 split covers whether doesn't matter whether it's gifted or not like gifted or prime or whatever it's still a 60 40 split if that makes sense All right, so we got to get in. We got because we need shroud wood. Fuck those bees. I ain't messing around with the bees today, okay? We're not messing with bees today. F all of that crap. Not even going to play with goddamn bees. Not today, Satan. Not today. Not today, Satan. All right, so let's check journal. What do, what do we got? Boutini shirt efforts have begun. Okay, so. Um, speaking of the Utini shirt or hoodie, my buddy who got laid off at a site similar to Snitch is going to help touch it up. Are you going to sell them or is that something that I have available to me to put up on my merch shop? <laughs> Story of rot. Clear the elixir. Oh, see. Yeah. Expand your home by upgrading the flame altar to increase your protection range. Upgrading the flame altar requires a shroud core, which is acquired by defeating boss enemies. Right. Story of Rot. Uh, the flame spoke of ancient obelisk, which reveal information about the world. The obelisks show hidden truths. Some are connected to what festers below. Forge a weapon. Okay, so... Chop down trees with a felling axe to gain wood logs. Got it. Okay, so... <sighs> Scavenger camp with mine shift, cinder vault... Flame, uh, there's a flame shrine over there? Ooh, I didn't know that. Yeah, clear the elixir well. We're not going there yet. We already did that. We already did the ancient vault blacksmith. Flame shrine, flame shrine, flame shrine. Ancient obelisk.
Love letter to Queen Jas Jasmina Flame Shrine. Flame Shrine. Story of Ra. Oh. I kind of want to check the story of Ra. You know what I mean? Guard harvest. Do we have. All right. Um. Okay, so shield. Right, we already have the shield. Yeah, this is all stuff that I can. All right, this is the stuff that I can craft. Uh, oh, we have two points. Okay. Um. Assassin. I kind of want to go with warrior constitution increases 50 health by increases health by 50 per attribute point barbarian huh mason pickaxe deals 30 percent more damage against stone objects including resource veins miner when you mine resources you have a 10 percent chance to get one additional resource quality gear all to out of reach oh because i need this first got it power parry Increases the enemy stun bar gain on parry attacks. Constitution. Heavy handed enemy stun bars increased by when they're when attacking into their block with okay. Um sh sheesh. Unlock that one. Okay. Unlock that one. Okay. Strength four. All right. That should actually increase. I mean, come at me, boys. Giving me something more like freaking meat, man. I could have used a little bit of meat, you bastard. All right. Uh, we need to get down here. Dad needs shroud wood. And the shroud liquid, too. Come on. All right. Shrouded, here we go. Collect, 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 collect. Touch it up, shroud would sound, I mean, listen. <laughs> right, shroud would. All right, so twigs. Ah, damn it. The sound down here does not leave one uh, feeling comfortable, if you know what I mean. it being down here if you know what I mean chat the shroud does not fill me with a great deal of confidence so the shrouded lands look like they had an oil spill ah it's because this whole entire area is like it's toxic
Flintstone, I will take the Flintstone. Uh, you know what? We're going to do the Metal Star Mace. I feel like that. Wow, this looks spicy in here, by the way. Getting spicy down here. Oh shit! Ow! Ow! Mistakes were made. Fuck! <laughs> oh balls! Sakura blue. All right, uh, <clears throat> God damn it. Damn it, Bobby. Death drinks. I, <laughs> I don't have alcohol. I can't drink. There's no alcohol here. How am I supposed to have a drink if there's no booze here, chat? Hmm? Hmm? How is that supposed to have a drink if there's no goddamn booze here? Right, so we're gonna do six. Uh, heal ourselves up a little bit. That's that. That's the stuff. That's the ticket right there. That's the good stuff. Oh, oh, oh! There we go. Uh, we want that. Hold the cook. Finish the release. Call it the LCBO. Have it delivered. You can't have booze delivered. Okay. It's not how the LCBO works, sir. It's, it's not, the LCBO does not function the same as, uh, you know, uh, buying booze in the States does. No. <laughs> no. But this, you can sell it here in the community, but I'll clean it up and get wider and get the wider world. When we're done cleaning and perfecting it, well, we'll update you too. I mean, either or. I'm not, I, I'm just, I was asking. How's that? I was asking. I felt it was appropriate to ask. If you can sell it here, make a few bucks, great. I would just throw it like, throw it up in the, uh, the existing merch shop, that's all. Oh. Give me your stuff. Your soul is mine. All right, now I have to go back down and get my goddamn st god darn stuff. You son of a bitch. I want to have to go back down there. Shit. Now I don't have a choice. God darn it. That's right, run a shame. You know it. That's right, it is the old run a shame, chat. You know it, you love it, you're used to it. Every single one of us have had a run of shame. I will take those arrows. Pointy ass, mother trucking arrows. Oh, well, we've already seen me do a couple of runs of shame too, right? Like it's, <laughs> it is definitely a thing. Oh. Ooh, you sweet beauties look at you oh I will gladly take the explosives thank you oh Jesus Freaking. you know what I had time for your crap Get 
Get bent. Blunt object works great. Hatchet. Level three. Uncommon. Oh my. Okay, well, let's, uh, let's see how much different this one is compared to the one we're already using. Okay, that's a level three. That's a level one. This is a common. This is an uncommon. We're going to take that one. We're going to throw that in the backpack. And we're going to salvage. Boom! Ruins. Nice. Now we got a shiny new level three. Freaking uncommon. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's go. The actions. Mm-mm-mm. Mm-mm. That's tasty. Let's freaking go. I'll loot that, too. Uh, yep. And the bandage? Sure, why not? Okay. I'm just starting to realize all of a sudden it's like, hey, uh, I just realized. Level three hatchet. Da be yeah, goddamn be right? The goddamn bees, man. Goddamn bees. Freaking bees. I'm sons of bitches. Alright, well, problem is now we gotta do a corpse crawl. I catch up to where my body is. Guys to get me my body back. Chat. Uh I uh, actually hold on. Come on! Oh! Woo! Shit. Apprentice wand. Mid-range weapon. Level 3. Ice. <gasps> Woo! Yes, please. Let's go. Yeah, man. into the shroud so dad can get his stuff back from that goddamn cave a freaking pleb I'm getting my stuff and then we're getting the hell and then we're dipping the hell out I'm hoping that the dude down here has not respawned. Oh, there's my stuff. Give me my shit back. Sharpened broadsword. Take all, it's mine. Thank you. Hey, what do we got here? Ooh, ring of endless life. Woo! Legendary. Let's go. Okay. Okay, we are getting the f out of here now, aren't we? Yep. I ain't sticking around. Nope. We we out this bitch. <laughs> we out this bitch. I love that I can just tell the story to fuck off and get tired of dying and just do- Yes, right? Well, it's the same idea as Valheim, right? 
Legend... <laughs> Legendary! Oh my! Sounds like a problem for those who suffer from uh, lactose intolerance. Character. Like, well, I love this. We're going to throw that on instead because oh, 3% life, life leech. Yes, please. We'll take that. Thank you. No grappling hook yet. No, nope, we don't have a bag expansion. Okay, let's get the frack out of here. Bruh. I'll be honest, I wasn't expecting that to, ha to happen like that, and I'm very happy that it did, but we are getting the hell out of here. I don't want to be in the shroud in the dark, because this is a dangerous time. Oh, you mean the, the main br uh, the bridge? Yeah, the main bridge. That would be kind of cool if you could... Uh, you know what? Let's, uh, yeah. Actually, hold on. Let's do that one. Oh, I really don't like the sounds out here at night. That's not a good time. Definitely not a good time. The sounds out here at night suck. Not so bad once you get to the moon. Moon's up. Okay, so well, let's do that. Do 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 do. Abra Abra Second Amendment shoots. Oh shit. Wow. Hi, boys. Was not expecting that, but hey, look what we got. Look at all of this bullshit right here. Look at all this bullshit right here. You know what? I will gladly take your souls. Thank you. Perfect. Love it. Beautiful. Effective. Fair fantastic. So, I don't know if you guys happen to notice or not, but these things really don't like light. Those suckers wander into my base every- they wander into your base? Oof. That's- that's no bueno. Shit that wanders into your base does not sound like a good time. Ow, my cankles. Shit. Freaking hurt. My freaking cankles shot. Oh, hi, my freaking cankles. I was out taking one down off the small hills with a pickaxe. They tried and tried to jump. Oh, tried to jump you, huh? Speaking of which, oh hi, I see you. Get after, sir. The one thing I've actually come to notice too is that the day cycle, the day cycle seems really effing short.
Like the day cycle seems so flippin' short. If you sleep it speeds it up, but yeah. No, I mean the night cycle is short, right? Like when you sleep makes the night cycle shorter. But I mean the day cycle itself seems really short. How much charcoal do we have? Hey, that's what I want to see right there. Look at this. Look at this. Holy crap. Let's freaking go, man. You know what? Let's uh let's throw that in there too. Um Let's select that. We're gonna change it up. I think we got enough. We we need some tar now. Okay. Abraka wizard off. Oh, Abraka wizard. Yeah. So not paying attention. What does that do? Hey, you know what? This bed looks awful cute. Dumbass. Do 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 do. Here we go. Done. Okay, how about we just sleep in the damn <laughs> Sheesh. No, what I mean is the day cycle seems like incredibly short, right? Like that's that's the one thing that kind of bothers me is it's like the day cycle just seems really short. Now listen, don't give me that freaking jerky freaking attitude. What do we need for the Porsche? Uh, ugh. Okay, so we have that. I need more metal scrap. Felling axes, huh? Scrappy axe. Metal scraps. Shroud wood. String. Well. Bone meal. I need six bone meal, two, four metal sheets, and charcoal. Okay, I also need the forge, but... Uh, let's, yeah, I think we'll grab, we'll get the felling axe, we'll get, so we'll get the new pickaxe. I have four metal scraps. Just, let's, uh, metal scraps. Okay, I want, we're gonna grab that, we're gonna grab that. Uh, what else did I need? String? Boy, there we go. Can I? No, I still need. I need more metal scraps. Okay, so we've got the scrap yaks. So the scrap yaks will replace the, the axe. Okay. There we go. An axe made out of scrap metal with improved durability and efficiency compared to the axe. Beautiful. That's what we needed. Fan freaking tastic. All right, so we will come in here. Um, Princess wand, crackling wand. Uh, we're gonna swap that around for that. Crackling wand, plus two mana regen. Okay, so they're both basically the same. They they both do the same. Just one does fire, one does. You know what? We're gonna let's throw that one in there. Uh, do, 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 Throw that in there, that in there. Those in there. Oh, that's maxed out. Got it. Okay. That's maxed out. Got it. Flint. Uh, shroud wood. Didn't have any shroud wood up until now. Got it. Check. Uh, we'll throw that in there. Stone. Twigs. The fiber in. Uh, I'm gonna keep the scrap metal and the charcoal. We're gonna put the string in. That and that. Actually, you know what? We'll just start throwing everything in there. With the exception of that, we're gonna cook that up. Can I? No. We're gonna delete that. Okay. Salvage that. Ruins. 
Okay, so... Okay, so it's good to see that some things actually stack over 50. That is actually really good to see. Alright, so let's do... Drink that. Give ourselves a little noms. Okay. Right, so, um, we have, okay, I want to, you know what, I want to check out the, the new Scrappy Axe here. Okay, well, really, twigs, that's it? Okay, you know what, we'll do this then, Jesus. So here's a question, where do I find, uh, scrap metal? Like, is that, a, does anybody, does anybody actually know where you find scrap metal in large quantities? Yeah, that's not bad. Well, bandages are doing a lot more healing a lot more, so that's good. Um You know what? Hold on. I want to try something. Scrap arrow, wood logs. Judge me, chat. I'm trying something, okay? Hmm. Flint arrow, huh? Interesting. I mean, I like the fact that I can collect the arrows from there, but... The issue that I'm now currently having is... I would very much like to... Excuse me? Oh, we're gonna take that and that. Okay. Dude, I was doing the same thing, just dismantling the runes for resources. Well, and that's... Like, uh, that's what I was wondering is... Now, the problem is, you notice that you're, like, the axe, for instance, uh, took a considerable, considerable amount more damage. Like... Breaking all of this stuff down. Now, I want to... Oh, I need the flame altar nearby. Well, let me do the thing. Shit. If I move a flame altar into this area, it would allow me to harvest this. All right, uh, we need to, okay, so there's,
so you can only oh you can only fast travel to the last visited altar huh okay flame shrine flame shrine there's a flame shrine here let's set that one as a waypoint So being on the on roads actually allows you to move faster too. That is something I've already figured out as well. That is good to know. So we've got the building aspect kind of for the most part figured out, which is really freaking dope. We've already got the blacksmith. We've got a kiln. So we got just this quick little place. We got our flame altar. Um, as you can see, it's just just kind of ah, listen. Don't be waving at me, you bastard. I ain't got nothing for you right now. I'm busy. Can't you see I'm running through the woods? All right, here we go. Um, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. That could have been really bad. <laughs> Holy shit. I was like, all of a sudden, I'm like, uh, oh, shit. Oh, come on. Coffee, do you enjoy the game Valheim? But wish Valheim had more story. Well, yeah, it's a good thing I can get my stuff back. I didn't mean to put I didn't mean push like that. Listen, coffee, it's all good. <laughs> How are you doing? Didn't get into Valheim, friends wouldn't play. I listen, Valheim is a ton of fun playing solo. I play it primarily solo. I don't I don't need friends to be able to enjoy a game like that. It's the same with with this one. Don't wait for your friends, just play it. Just if you, if you enjoy like building and crafting and stuff like that in a video game, just play the game. Don't worry about your friends. Don't, don't, you don't need people to enjoy a game. You don't need those people. What do you need them people for to enjoy a goddamn game, sir? Come on. You're better than that. Game is like, wait, you want to go where? Yeah, that's pretty much exactly what just happened, too. Woo! That's pretty much exactly what just happened there, too. It's like, wait, you want to... No, this isn't an MMO. This is a co-op game. This is a co-op. You can play solo. I'm playing solo. You don't need, there are no servers. It's not a pay to play. It is you buy the game once and that's it. You own it. This is a co pure co-op game. And I highly recommend, hi Casper, how are you doing? I, I 100% like I purely I highly recommend just buying the game and picking it up and playing it Yeah, I'm probably gonna have to dig down to it. I'm, I'm actually thinking that Yeah, looks like But do you need to pay for hosting? No, you can host on your own machine. This is, are you sure? I'm pretty sure this turned into death loop. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure this is death loop at this point.
All right, uh, let's do this. See, is it, it's it's kind of funny. I keep forgetting that this is actually an option. Thank you for my stuff, you son of a bitch. Uh, so that flame altar is down there. So what I'm thinking, hear me out, hear me out. This this is what I'm thinking, chat. Okay. Okay. Hear me out. This is what this is what I'm this is what dad's thinking. <laughs> we're gonna dig we're gonna dig through the fucking hill. We're just building a goddamn tunnel. Yeah, we're doing a diggy diggy tunnel. Screw this crap. I'm done with this shit. We're building a diggy diggy tunnel. This is gonna take a bit, isn't it? <laughs> Shit. So severe arthritis in back, something to do with a disc in my mother's lower back. Spinal stenosis is what it actually sounds more like. Sounds more like spinal stenosis. Something to which I am incredibly familiar. This could take a bit, chat. <laughs> This is going to take a little bit. Yeah, bulging discs do hurt like a bastard. Okay, uh, now. So, anybody see the problem? <laughs> Give me your stuff. This game needs chaos mod. No, actually it doesn't. Don't you even start with that, sleepy. This one needs can't. No, it doesn't. Why would you? Do you hate dad? Is that what it is? You hate dad, don't you? You hate dad so much. So you know what make this better? You know I'll make this better? Chaos mods. Why, why do you hate dad so much? Why do you hate dad so much? You're like, hey, you know what? What happened? Let's do chaos mods. What happened? No. You know... It'd be nice if that was good for storage, you know what I mean? Uh, we're gonna 
throw that in there. We're going to throw the bone in there. We're going to throw those in there. And the wood logs and this we're going to put in here. So we're going to throw that and that in there. So we have a bunch of tar. We got a bunch of charcoal. Let's change that over to wood acid. Let's go. Boom. See, here's the thing I don't understand how chaos mods. Of course, my father didn't explain things too well. Yeah. So I'm guessing your mom's going to be, uh, is, is your mom slated to come, come home anytime soon or? I didn't even know this was here. Shit. Oh, we're taking that for sure. Holy hell. Hey, all right. Not today. I got you. All right, here we go. Down into the little uh, tunnel hidey hole. No, the fact that we have deformable freaking terrain like this is really handy. I mean, I technically could build an entire freaking location base underground. I'm kind of, you know, I'm kind of all right with that. So the one thing I've noticed is there seem to be a lot of people who think that Enshrouded is like a, like an MMO and I'm, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna straight out and let everyone know that this is not an MMO. This is a, a uh, story driven single player experience with co-op ta uh, tagged on. There are people who are running public servers. You do not have to have a server. You don't have to have a dedicated. It is not necessary. I do myself after like considering I am a big fan of uh, like Valheim. Oh, hell no. I would, you know what? Like if they added this to chaos mods, I'd be all right with that. Not even joking. I would actually be all right with that. I'm kind of glad that we don't have a carry weight because <laughs> holy shit. Carry weight in this would be terrible. Let's throw that in there. At speed signs, I told you how fast you were going to get you to slow down. Someone stole the sign. We have those all around here. Those are pretty much on the edge of every single town everywhere. 
and they don't go missing. Nobody wants to fuck with them because they've got cameras mounted on them. They're wired in. They're fucking... These things are transmitting fucking pho photos all the time in fucking videos. So, anybody wants to steal them, I mean, go right ahead. If you want that fucking level of bullshit on your head, give her, but... I don't know why you'd want that. That makes you a special kind of stupid in my book. That just makes you a special kind of dumb in my book. I don't even know if I'm not even probably close. <laughs> like shit. Local D was Okay, that means more tickets then. Like that was supposed to scare us. It acts it acts as a bit of a deterrent here. People tend to not like getting speeding tickets. I mean usually as a rule. Yes, I'm trying to widen this out a little bit so I get some light in here so I can see what the hell I'm doing. I can't see shit. <laughs> so I'm like... Aziz, more light! <laughs> More light! Oh, damn it. Okay, well, looks like... <laughs> okay, I gotta answer my mom. Uh, the tunnel might not stay there. I did a quick search, and there's people already saying that anything outside your base resets every so often. You know what? I'm kind of expecting that. That's fine. Not a big deal. We'll see how it goes, okay? We'll just see how it goes. People who do those types of things don't come crying if you get cut. I mean, right? It's kind of like the same idea of talk shit get hit. And that's effectively what it is in my book. It's like talk shit get hit. How we doing on the... Hey, that wood acid seems to be doing okay. We're going to throw a little bit more of the dirt in there. We still got lots of wood. How we doing? Oh, we doing all right. We doing all right. We doing all right. Okay. Definitely arthritis. Herniated disc. Yikes. Oofers. Ooferinos. Stamp. There we go. 
Folks, if you're just joining us, welcome. I'm your host, Scott. Welcome to the arcade. Happy Monday. Hope you're well. What are you people doing? You're just sitting here being all cute, but you're not saying a whole lot. You know. You can't just be cute and sit there and do nothing or say nothing. I'm working, damn it. Listen. No excuses. I'm working. I'm being cute. I'm on my digital street corner. Have to pay the inter for the internet so I can watch. Damn it, that's a question. What? That I'm cute? Nah, that's not questionable. It's factual. I'm just not cute to you. That's different. That doesn't mean I'm not cute, just not to you. Me, me making the statement that I'm cute is still factually correct. Okay, come on, man. All right, uh, we're done for the evening. We're gonna, <laughs> I'm like, yo, it's dark. How the fuck do I get out of here? Chad, I'm stuck in my hole. Your soul is mine. Aha, sucker. You know, you could give me something more than some cloth. Where's the metal scraps, man? Where's the gold darn metal scraps, man? Okay, everything is uh, all nicely fixed up again. Let's get in here. We're going to get ourselves to sleep. Of that. Night speed 60. What are we doing over here? I mean, it's still working away. It's still doing its thing. Now we've got tar, we've got charcoal, and now I have wood acid. So what does that allow me to make? Let's let's have a quick look here. Uh, rough wood block, rough flintstone block, metal. Ah, yikes! Invanescent block, mycelium overgrown block. Shroudwood block. Shroudwood looks really nice, actually. Tarred shingle roof block. <gasps> oh, it's beautiful. Holy shit. Damn. Oh, yeah, that the stone shingle roof looks good. I like how that looks. That looks gorgeous. A decorative object to design and beautify your home. Crude wooden fence. Uh, listen, I don't know about the bowls, you know, like... What freaking good is that? Like, does this... does? It, I mean, it beautifies your home. Does it make your home more comfortable? That's, I guess, the real question. Illumination? Wax and string. Plus two comfort illu... Oh, what? Freaking what? Okay, hold on. Wait a minute. Okay, hold on. Hold on. We're gonna grab some of this. We're gonna grab the wax. What do we got for wax? We got like five of these. You mean to tell me? 
If we make two of those, all items repaired, that's fine. And then we say, oh, I don't know. We go here and we do number six and we put that there. Holy shit. Freaking what? Okay. That's... That's pretty nice. I'm not gonna lie. That's pretty nice. Alrighty then. That means that we're gonna have to... Alright, so we got... Yeah, that, 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 that. Alright. We're gonna throw that in. We're gonna throw that in there. Three... Okay, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I wanna know. How much stone? So the stone can definitely stack. Like there is no doubt of the stone stacking. That is not an issue. Holy shit. Do we, we do not currently have it. Okay, so uh, we need wood. So let's go cut down a tree. Get some more wood. All right, we need some logs. Why do we need the logs, you might ask? Because we need to build a goddamn chair. Because apparently that adds to the comfort level, which gives us way more rested bonus. And I'll be honest, I was not expecting that. I was like, holy shit. Stool, we're gonna craft one. Let's go. Craft a stool. Come in here. Ooh! Yes, please. Holy shit, that is... Okay. Man, I've been playing this game wrong the entire time. Been playing the game wrong the entire goddamn time. What else can we do here? Tables. Plus one. Plus two. Nothing. Okay, well, we got this little one. The crude little side table. We got that. Provides comfort, increasing the duration of rested buff. Oh, we need resin for that, huh? What? Well, let's, uh, can it be plant? Okay, something I want to check. We're going to find out. We're going to see if we can do this. I would like to find out if I craft that. We do Fuck yeah, there we go. Mm, okay, so it doesn't actually... That's... Cannot be... Okay, cannot build here. Fine. I get what you're saying. Hi ho, hi ho. All right. So now that now that we figured that out, I'm gonna harvest that. By the way. All right, let's get back to digging this bloody tunnel here. Woo! It's getting dark down here. Okay, hold on. Hold, 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 hold on. All 
Alright, there we go. Just gotta clear some of this crap out of the way. Open this up a little bit. Aziz! Light! Shit. God damn it, Bobby. Finally got around to registering with the municipal fiber company rolling out service in my town. We'll get notification when service is up in my part of the town. They've got options up to 125 per month for two gig up down. Ooh, nice. Two gigabit up and down. That's nice. That's a spicy connection. Uh, the one thing, like, that's the thing. I'm super happy about the, like, the internet here is, like, fucking phenomenal. The one gig connection, up, like, the one gigabit sequential is so good. Definitely worth every fucking penny. Okay, that's that's a little bit better. Ish. <laughs> like, God damn it. Shit. I'm afraid we're gonna end up like popping through and it's all of a sudden we're just gonna be like on the on this cliff edge and just fall and lose all our shit. Which will upset me to no, no fucking, ex like, just. Uh, ask, ask Growing Pain next time you see him uh, how he feels about uh, Cox Cable. Just uh, trust me, ask him. He did an entire campaign online on Twitter against Cox to the point that Cox brought their lawyers in. It was an entire experience. Yeah. Uh, uh, so, Growing Pain, one of my moderators, uh, got tired of Cox and their shitty connections and started a campaign on Twitter um, that was Cox Sucks Cox. It got to the point where they got their lawyers involved. <laughs> yeah, they told him to, that's exactly it. They told him to knock it the fuck off. And he didn't have any issues with his internet until he started streaming. As soon as he hit the go live button within two minutes and he timed this shit. Disconnect, 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 disconnect. Just constant, like nothing worked online as Wi-Fi. Everything. It wasn't the router. It was, you know. And he was he was pretty well convinced that it was uh, Cox actually limiting his line, even though he was paying for, you know, no bandwidth limitations or anything. It was a whole entire thing, right? And as he put it, he goes, you know, it's really funny that, uh, you know, it only ever happened when he was streaming. Everything else worked fine. But if he, if he tried to stream, that was the only time he ever had a problem. That was the only time the connection would tank out on him. How the fuck am I not through that hill yet? Holy shit. Well, chat, to answer your question, can we build a hobbit hole? Yes. 
he never got it. He never got it resolved. He never actually got it resolved. Never got it fixed. He uh, switched over to a different service. He just he he told them he told them to go and f themselves. It's just done. Hundred percent, completely done. He was like, "No, nah, I'm finished. Fuck this." And you know what? I really don't blame him. I don't blame him at all. Not even a little bit. Don't blame him at all. Right, so the wood acid is coming along nicely. Um, let's throw this. I think the resin is... Did I put the resin back in here? No, I did not. But we're going to dump the stone in there because apparently we can have a metric buttload of stone. Let's throw that there. All right. Okay, you know what? Let's, uh, uh... We'll just, uh, yeah. It's like level 5. Level 12! Here we go. God, don't you start that crap. Do I have... 5. So you can build this stuff, but I can't say... Come on, man! What do you mean I can't sit on my own goddamn chair? You son of a bitch. Fine. Alright, this is what I'm gonna do. Chat. We've been live for almost three hours. I need to grab a short break, so I'm gonna get up. I'm gonna stretch my legs. I'm gonna go use the bathroom. I highly recommend all of you get up. Do the same. I'll meet you back here in a few minutes.
Hi, chat. Hello. Hi. How are you? What are you doing? All right, we're back. Break's done. Job's done. All right. I'm like, yo. Okay, so there's a little bit of, I don't know if you guys noticed, but there is a little bit of lag. But I'm not playing, this is my job. It's, it's funny how, I wish I was playing, but technically I'm working. I know that there are a lot of people who still have the old school uh, mindset of like, if you play video games for a living or work in the gaming industry that uh, you're just, you know, you're not working It's like, well, it can be. Sometimes it can be super frustrating though, as you guys have seen when I'm playing like um, Star Citizen, sometimes it can be very frustrating and aggravating. <laughs> Uh, all right, uh, are we gonna break through here at any point in time or is this gonna end up being like a giant big old cluster of BS? It's supposed to pop through. I was watching people tunnel yesterday and like last night and on uh, Saturday. It was like, you can pop through. People building full ass tunnels. That's why I just decided, okay, well, we're just gonna go straight through here. It's like, screw it. Oh, out of stamp. Wait, what? I mean, we're definitely getting closer. Yeah, but the thing is, though, is the amount of money that you can make as a creator, you have to be dedicated to it full time to actually make money. You got to understand. This isn't, this isn't something like you have to, you, there, there are no benefits. There is no health insurance. There are no days off. There is, you don't get holidays. You don't get vacation time, right? Like that shit don't exist. Oh, we found daylight. Holy shit. How close are we? Are we going to die if I drop off a, oh, Woo! ah, shit. Fuck. I mean, at least we found daylight. That's a start. <laughs> well, I mean, it's something. <laughs> hey, chat, look, we broke through. That's kind of what I'm planning on doing at this point. I'm, I'm gonna just carve a path. Because I'm too far away from the flame altar, I can't build a star ca uh, staircase. Starcase, staircase. Blah. Blah. Too bad you just don't have unlimited building like you do in Minecraft, right? Where you just build anywhere. I mean, I get why they don't have that, because then you just you'd literally be able to like avoid every goddamn thing. You'd be able to just like cheese build your way through the entire game. So I do kind of understand that, but. If 
Right, so we ended up going straight up a little bit here. So we're gonna... your face brother i'm loving and shrouded badger i'm i'm thoroughly enjoying this and i'm gonna be honest if any of you enjoy like games um that have that rpg element and building think seven days to die valheim stuff like that right so can confirm this game is worth it and again, I want to say thank you to Sleepy Developer because if it wasn't for Sleepy, we wouldn't be playing this game right now. Shoot down be have some trees. Yeah, don't worry, we got you. I got you, fam. Jay, I'm doing well, Jay. How are you, man? Okay, we got our nice again, we got we got ourselves a nice little log cabin already built. We're gonna have to do uh obviously we're gonna have to do some um expansion, but All right, let's... Throw that in the... Oh. And we'll take that. What have you been up to? So what is this game about? Okay, so... Um... This is a... Uh, a survival RPG. Uh, there is... Currently, we are in an area that is referred to as a highland. We don't have to have much to worry about here. Uh, we're in this open plain. As you can see, plenty of crafting material around. So you do your usual. You, you, you build up your material. You, you, uh, you build yourself a, a, little, a little place. We have an altar, right? This is, this is commune with the flame. This is our, this is our flame altar. This is what allows us to build in the area that we're in. So, as you can see, I break out the hammer. We have a build area, right? So the we are um, what is referred to as Flameborn. Uh, being the Flameborn means that you are the person responsible for bringing for clearing the shroud. So see this this foggy misty area. This this is the shroud. It is a magical toxic barrier that effect uh, that effectively turns like as you can see like completely desecrates everything around. Like 100% just kills everything. Chokes it off all plant life everything dead right so the flare altar the flame altar is basically the equivalent of the um well yes and no so while you can you build in the zone the flame altar is a protected area so that gives you the so by upgrading your your altar so extend its building range this allows you to build but in order to build you still need a crafting bench can we remove the toxic stuff? Yes, by removing the, the shroud root. So, uh, I'll discover, yeah. You can quickly navigate the categories. So as you can see, some recipes consist of series of items. Switch between these items here. Here you can find the requirements and ingredients for each recipe. You can pin recipes to, the note to get a notification once you've collected enough ingredients to craft the pinned recipe. You can also access your manual crafting recipes and your backpack at crafting stations. So anyways, uh, we'll back out from there. Open up the map. So this is the map. So our first boss encounter be here for the uh, clear the elixir well. So let's go to the journal and clear the elixir well. The blacksmith wants to fight against the shroud, the ruinous fog that has overtaken Embervale. The shroud springs from elixir, uh, elixir wells. Near, reach the nearby elixir well and learn more about the shroud. 
So, in each of these areas, there is going to generally be a, a boss encounter, a fight that you're going to have to work some form of mechanic around to actually defeat the boss. That boss is protecting a shroud root. The shroud root is what is responsible for this toxic ruinous fog that is enveloping the countryside right now. As you can see, we've already got one, one little, our, our blacksmith. This, this is the man's out here giving us, like, building us our gear. Uh, we've already got our wonderful, nice little uh, charcoal kiln, which we've got charcoal, tar, and now we've got wood acid being crafted. Uh, so, much like any other survival game, you have components required to, you know, to be able to actually craft up certain materials to be able to survive in the, uh, in the game world. Uh, including weapons, armor, food, and so forth. Rest is also very important in this, as you'll, uh, soon see in a moment. I'm um, just sort of organizing my goodies here. Don't mind me. Just gonna... Get ourselves a wee bit of sleep here. So going to speed, uh, going to sleep actually speeds things up at night. All right, it is now officially early morning. Let's get our asses back out there. All right, let's go. No, I, no, I don't want to. So yes, can we remove the toxic stuff? Yes. Is it going to be easy? Definitely not. Um, now, what I'm currently heading to, I've got a waypoint here set. Uh, because I need, uh, we're, we're trying to get to another, any, another flame altar. Not one of my own, but uh, there are flame altars all over the, scattered all over the game world. Uh, so what I've been doing is tunneling through this to get down because trying to, climb down otherwise is gonna murder me and I'd rather not die all right when my roommate gets home hopefully I need to make a quick run to a grocery store sometime before dinner because there's one little thing I need to finish dinner off and that is some chicken broth Trying to widen this out just a smidge. There we go. All right. So, Jay, what have you been up to? What have you been doing? What has kept my man, Big Jay, busy? I hope your family is doing well. Hope you're well. Uh, we're going to do that and that. Okay. Food is already active. Oh, it won't let me. Okay, fine, fine, fine. Don't. Whoa, easy there, trigger. What the hell? Oh. I'm bi I'm binding myself up here. I'm not digging down properly. That's the problem. There we go. Now we're getting somewhere. I gotta remember that I gotta dig the space out a little bit too while I'm digging down. Come on, man. So yeah, we are, we are the Flameborn. We are the ones who have the ability to actually, um, return life to, uh, to, to Embervale and other locations such as that.
So that is our task. To remove the shroud, find the other survivors, bring them all back, get them crafting us, uh, us all our good stuff to get us through all of this and get us to survive. Okay, we're just gonna nice and easily, nice and slow like. Oh shit, god damn. Aziz, light! I wish I could just repair my stuff on the fly here, by the way. That would be really nice instead of having to run back to the crafting table all the time to do it, but... I get why we're not allowed. I get why we have to do it the way we have to do it. Doesn't mean I like it! I understand why, I understand the mechanic behind it, but... Doesn't mean I have to like it. That's bright. God damn, that's bright. All right, so let's get back here. We'll uh, get our stuff fixed again. We'll get back into the hole. Prepared. All right. Back in the hole, chat. Get your ass back in the goddamn hole. Get your ass back in the hole. All right. We started so early in the morning that the sun just wasn't fully up at this point. It's like, shit. Now it's starting to get bright. This might actually be a little bit better. There we go. Starting to see a little bit more. A little more light through here. As I keep trying to cut through a little bit too, you guys probably noticed. Once in a while, I'll find a little chunk and I just widen it out a little bit. There we go. Okay, here we go. Oh God, back into the back into the pit, into the pit, chat, into the pit. Get in the pit. I mean, you could build inside the mountain. If you cleared out enough space and then placed your flame altar here, you could build inside the mountain. There are already people who've been doing that. But you have to have it le like in here and leveled out so that you can place down your flame altar and then build in the mountain. Now you can't build too far in because you could potentially end up getting yourself sealed in. You know what I mean? Okay, listen. Okay, we're just, we're prepping. We're building a fucking bunker, okay? We're building a bunker right now. You know what? Listen, I just need to break through. Jesus, just let me break through. We've already broken through up above us, but we need to be lower down. Oh, oh, we're breaking through.
Daylight. Oh, sweet Jesus. Look, it's daylight. Am I making a woodshed in the side of the mountain? I mean, we could be making a woodshed in the side of the mountain. It kind of looks like we are, doesn't it? Woo! Okay, well, we're back outside where we can see what the hell we're doing as we carve our way down. <laughs> Shit. Because dropping 200 meters is not my idea of a good time. I don't know about you guys. I'm just, listen, I'm just, I got this problem with dropping 200 meters, okay? It's not my idea of a good time. Well, 202 meters to be exact. Because I don't have a glider yet. the glider that allows it or the grappling hook that allows me to freaking do all the crazy shit in this game for uh, getting around yet okay do not have that oh there we go broke it broke it you know what we're getting closer okay I'm pulling a seven dwarves You'd almost think I was, uh, you know, part of the part of the dwarven clans from Moria. This is the only downside. Got to keep running back to to repair the. Now that being said, can't okay, craft. Uh. What? Y y listen, har yourself, okay? Uh, pickaxe. What do I need? I need metal scraps and shroud wood. You know what? We're going to pin that. Let's have a quick look. I want to see. Because I think we need a better pickaxe. We have the shroud wood. We only have one metal scrap. Well, that's balls. All right. That seems to be coming along nicely. What do we got left in our backpack? Got a little bit of bone. All right. Um, you know what? Hold on a second. Give me a minute here, all right? Just give, give Dad a quick minute. Okay, so... Alright, that's kind of what I was guessing. Alright, fine. Okay. I have a better idea. I have a better idea. Alright, we're gonna... We're gonna... We're gonna come back to the hole in a moment. We're gonna come back to the hole in a moment, okay? We're, uh, we're gonna go back up to the cinder vault here for a quick minute. Call me crazy. 
If you fall, yes, I, I already know about falling in the beacon and yada 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 yada. Okay, okay, we already know about that. What we're gonna do is we're gonna go in here. I'm gonna reignite that mother trucker. <laughs> All right, yeah, you give me your stuff. You give me your stuff. Yup, all right. Excuse me. How do I, ah, I'm like, uh, pardon me? Mother trucker. I mean, that works, but that's better. There we go. Aha. We'll, uh, we'll take the extra torch just in case that we're going to need it. I have an idea. Is there does not appear to be a chest or anything here, does there? No. Does not. Okay, that's you know what? That's fine. No chest, no chest. We'll grab another torch. Why not? Can't have too many torches, chat. Cannot have too many torches. Uh to take that poor poor corpse's bones I kind of feel bad I feel bad I do so we need metal scrap or scrap metal however you want to put it stone really mother trucker Let me in. Let me in, you bitch. Can't. I just kind of hope. Nothing? Oh, diabolical. That's terrible. Shit. How in the hell do you find stuff? You know what? Let's. Ineffective. I was kind of hoping that maybe. Nope. Fuck. Damn it. These things are metal. Why can I not get scrap metal from these? I feel like I've been ripped off. I've been told a lie. Chat. And these appear to be indestructible. Well, son of a bitch. I was lied to. Nope. Is this? No. Well, fuck. How in the hell? So apparently you're able, you're supposed to be able to farm material here in the cinder vault, but that is a lie. That much is obviously untrue. Because if it was true, 
Then we'd already have scrap metal, but we don't. We don't have any. Wait a minute. Hold on. Wait a minute. Hold on. Hold the freaking phone. Must be farming wine, and you just never, you monster. I'm gonna kick you in your crotch. Nope. Alright, well, hey. You don't know if you don't try, chat. You don't know if you don't try. What are you doing, Slider? Huh? What are you doing, sir? All right, all right, all right. What if I come in here and we do this and we do... You. You. Good luck. Shit. Well... Damn it. Okay. That, uh, nope. Obviously, that doesn't work. Boo! Boo! Whoa! Oh, wait, 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 wait. Whoa! Shite. Aha! Give me your stuff. Wood logs. Boo! Wood logs. God damn it. <laughs> it's just like, game's like, yeah, uh, so you wanted to do what? Uh, you wanted to... Right, okay. Oh. Oh, keyed in. That's not gonna work for me. No, sir. No, siree, bub. I don't like how that works. We're gonna have to find a different way, aren't we? Shadow, we already took all the clankers out of here. We good? Yeah, we good. All right. If you fall, you will rise again at your last return beacon, which is uh, our home chat. If you're just joining us, hi, welcome. Thanks for being here. I hope you're well. I hope you're having a good Wednesday. Or Wednesday, Monday. Holy hell! We already, yeah, that's it. We, we're already, we're already in Wednesday. Just boom, Wednesday. Where's your heart, okay? And Doggo is whining. I promise you, I'm not actually drunk, okay? I'm not. I can guarantee most definitely not drunk. seem like I should be able to break all of this and like get scrap metal from it but I uh, don't seem to be able to we're getting all sorts of everything else just no metal scrap hmm well that's a thing isn't it No metal scrap. Interesting. All right, so we're gonna scoop that water first. 
So we need eight metal. So the shroud wood I already have. We just don't have the metal scraps. Right, let's make it back. So I need scavengers. Huh. All right. So we need, uh, I am, I am honestly enjoying this, but, and now that I've got the, the building kind of figured out, that really makes a massive difference overall. Okay, so we'll let that boost up for a quick moment. Okay. Where are we? 17 minutes? Okay. Alright, everything has been repaired. So, let's see. So, that's Flint. At least I do believe... Um, let's double check that. I'm gonna... Flintstone. Yep, that's Flintstone. Okay. And Flintstone as in not the Flintstones from Bedrock, but... <laughs> Just so we're clear. All right, let's. <laughs> like, apparently, I'm uh, burning, 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 burning through all my uh, stam here. Oh, one nice thing is there does seem to be a fair chunk of this here. So let's. Okay, and grab some of that there corn. We're sheltered. <laughs> As we start pit mining again. Okay, enough of that. Enough of the mining. Uh, no, Flint is in there. Yes. Okay, so we'll throw that in there. Um, no, cloth will, oh, right, cloth will not. Okay, so a thousand is the maximum for stone in a stack. Good to know. Considering everything else seems to be in the realm of um, 50, the stone goes up to uh, stacks of have rubble and dirt. Uh, actually, no, I want the dirt. I'll throw the stone in there and do I have sticks? We do have sticks. There we go, chat. We have sticks. I'm just going to throw all the torches in, except for one. Fill that and that. Okay. Um. Yeah, that's fine. You know what? That's fine. Okay. Oh can't sleep yet. It's not nighttime. Interesting. Okay, so you just can't speed up time that way. Good to know. That was actually something I wasn't sure of, and now we know. You can't just automatically speed up time by uh, jumping into a bed and just like...
Right, so in order to get scrap, I need to find scavengers or scavenger camps. Hmm. We've already kind of taken care of all the scavengers in the area. I haven't come across any any scavengers recently. Okay. Uh, let's check our map here. What do we got? Scavenger camp with mine shaft. Set that as waypoint. We'll go and check that camp again. Maybe we will come across some uh, some tasty little scrap bits. We'll see how that goes. We still got a little bit of daylight, so it shouldn't be too difficult to get up there. Are you winning, son? Oh, goddamn, those bees, man. Freaking bees everywhere, you sons of bitches. Wow, that got dark real fast, didn't it? Whew. Okay, what do we got up here? We got any scavengers up? We do! Hey, come on. Come on, bud. Let's go. Was cutting it a little close. Okay, there we go. Metal scraps. Okay. Wow, that was way too close for comfort. See what we've got here. Nothing. Uh, definitely not sleeping here, that's for sure. Oh! Hey! Wasn't sure that was gonna work. Okay, we got some metal scraps there. Bones. I was kind of hoping some of this stuff might... No, no. Damn it. Come on, man. Bones. Poop. Hey, there we go. Metal scraps. Okay. So we can make a better pickaxe now. So we already have the shroud wood. You know, it'd be real. Oh, I don't have a grappling hook yet either. Damn it. Ooh, I didn't know I could do that. That is actually kind of dope. I'm going to make a few more versions and have them play with it. Okay. Oh, 
Oh, yeah, sure, why not? We'll, we'll, we'll collect all that. Why not? Is it okay for me to be a little disappoint right now? I was kind of hoping that, you know, might get some nail- uh, old books. What the hell am I gonna do with the old books? Hmm. Hmm. Pressing X to doubt chat. Dad is pressing the X's to doubt. Oh god, it is dark AF. Can't see shit out here. We can't see diddly squat. Well, it is definitely nighttime, so uh, let's let us make haste back for base. <laughs> Cause I'm like shit. Spoke to my buddy; he agreed. We need font swaps for better font, and to 100% uh, avoid any legal BS. It's licensed, but that don't stop lawyers from being annoyed. Oh uh, yeah, that's, uh, you're not wrong there. That is 100% accurate and correct, Slider. Gonna make a few more versions and have them play with it. I mean, you know, it's all good. I get it. Right. Okay, uh, you, sir. Yeah, we're gonna, dad needs, okay, I need the shroud wood first. Okay, you know what? How about we get some rest? I'll talk to you in the morning. Okay, this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna get some rest. I'll talk to the man's in the morning, okay? Uh, we need Shredwood. There. The east. Uh, we will da dat and dat, yeah. Salvage that. Okay. Delete that. Uh, we're gonna throw that in there. We'll throw the stone in there. Um, rubble. Yeah, sure. Why not? Um, take. Gonna take. The, trust me. We're we're just. That's trying to arrange some stuff. Okay. Just, Bear with me. Organization. This is this is this is turning into a problem, okay? 100% can confirm turning into a problem. Okay, so the ruins go up over. Okay, that's good to know. Nice. That man's way too happy. Okay, we're gonna give that. Oh, no, 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 we're gonna throw that in there. We will throw the that in there, though. Right. Uh, no, I didn't grab the shroud wood. All that, what did Dad do? Forgot the shroud wood. Sheesh. Very difficult to do anything with the shroud wood if I don't have it in my backpack. There we go, scrappy axe. Boom, done. Van Scrappy X. Spiked Club. I kind of want the Spectral Shield. See, I'm not like the Scrappy Sword. I'm like, you know. Hey, don't, don't, don't shit talk me, sir. Don't, don't do that. Don't do that, sir. Geely. Okay. Now that we can effectively do this and throw that in there and the shroud wood back in, uh, let us get to, whoop. Uh, you know what? We're going to salvage that. And then we're gonna cook. We're gonna go for five, and we're gonna hold to cook the raw wolf meat. 
Okay, now we can continue with the original goal. So let's nom that. We're gonna nom that back. We're gonna get us a little bit of a big old drinky drink there. And can uh, that food is already active? Fair enough. Oh yeah, let's go. Let's freaking go! So I love how it says expand your home, but the problem is, um, in order to do the next expansion, uh, that actually requires us, there we go, that's what I'm looking for, uh, to take out the boss. Okay, uh, let's cut through here a little bit. You know what, I'm making sure that that's actually, I like that. It's like cut through just a bit, keep tunneling down, then punch another hole through uh, while we're doing this. It's like making sure we got air holes. Uh, where, right, we're headed to set his waypoint. problem now is going to be our stamina. I don't know if you guys happen to notice, but our stamina is uh, <coughs> a little rough. <laughs> it's... Oh, what time is it? Okay, 531. We'll just... All right, so the scrappy, the scrappy pickaxe definitely doing a better job. Uh, no. Stamina in the game, you son of a bitch. I have the stamina of a 20-something. IRL. I actually have somebody who's willing to confirm that, too. Trusted source. Listen, you know what? Like, hey. <laughs> Uh, I'm sorry for anybody who, who has a problem. <laughs> Feels bad, man. She wouldn't be in my circle if she wasn't trustworthy. Let's just put it that way. She wouldn't be in in my circle if she wasn't trustworthy. Oh, Jesus. Well, we have 180 meters to go, man. I can't just spit myself off the cliff here because I'll still die. I'll break my ankles. And very soon I am going to have to run back, though. My, my character stamina is no longer the issue. The issue is the pickaxe is about to bust. All right, there we go. 
There we go. Now we're getting somewhere. All right. Okay. I'm going to go back and repair because that's definitely going to be a thing. Oh, shit. trying to keep as much light as I can in here too. Now the one thing I'm noticing, I don't know if you guys have actually noticed. Oh, there we go. She's broken now. Now we have no choice. We got to go back. Where's my die point? Well, I'm not trying to you mean my spawn point? So if I die, I'm not trying to get to a death point. Um my spawn point is over here where my house is. Um, I don't know, uh, I know that, you know, if you fall about 20 meters, you're gonna, you'll break your cankles. You, you're gonna, you're gonna, like, you're gonna sprinkle the shit out of yourself, right? And if you notice, like, the base isn't too far away, but I'm just trying to, like, do, I'm doing this to get to, uh, one of the, uh, one of the flame altars. Uh, I want to do that, please. Thank you. All right. So basically what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to carve a path down this cliff face because I don't have my glider and I don't have a grappling hook yet. So we're just uh we're just carving our carving our way down through the uh <laughs> through nature. There's We're just strip mining our way down, don't worry. Nothing nothing major. I mean, we're only 175 meters away from our destination. not that bad. All right, all right, all right. Yeah, that's... Oh, shit. Don't freaking slide down the hill, bud. It's a terrible idea. If I take it this way. There we go. Classified as sheltered again. This is taking forever. <laughs> Holy hell. This reminds me of uh, trying to like dig down deep in Minecraft. Yeah, so character stamina is definitely a thing here. Thank you. 
the character stamina is turning into a bit of a bit of a focal point. Stamina, maximum. Boom, done. Yet, yeah, still digging. I mean, we're a lot closer now. And we've got a couple of points where we've cut through. So I keep, I keep poking her head out. I mean, I might be able to, but the problem is then how the fuck do I get back up? So I figure it's better, it's safer to just dig down. I am not jumping. So there's a marker, there's a waypoint that I'm trying to reach uh, for one of the flame altars. The problem is, yeah, if I jump, that's great. But here's the problem, I jump, how do I get back up? Whereas right now where I am, while this is kind of tedious to do, I can at least get back up and go repair, right? But the reason we're doing this is without the glider and without the grappling hook, there is no other way. Uh, no, unfortunately you can't dig in, well, Kind of digging steps, you know, but all right, yeah. Okay. Oh, 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 ah, uh, excuse me, sir. Excuse me. Not every game has, you know, gripping gameplay at the very start, especially when you're trying to figure out how the mechanics work and how to traverse. Like, I already know. If I had the glider, we could easily do this, but the problem is I don't have the glider. So there's no easy way about this. It's just like... Digging down, baby. But now I've got to go back and we've got to repair the... we got to get the pickaxe repaired. But the nice thing is, again, we're not too far away from the goal. We're almost down there, and all I've got to do is get back. We'll repair this again. We'll be able to get down there and actually, you know. I had a sinking suspicion that digging through was going to take some time, but again, like, I don't see the problem with, with taking a little bit of time. You know what I mean? Uh, because I don't have the material for a second pick, that's the problem. You just did a little shoe repair. Right, exactly. A little, little repair. Because it took, it took a bit of work just to get the material to build one. This is, e this is, doing this is still easier and faster than trying to farm the material to build another pickaxe. At least currently. Now that's not to say later in the game that that won't change, but... All right, here we go. All right, if you're wondering what I'm currently doing, all right, 
Let's... I'm trying to widen this out just a bit, okay? You'll see what I'm doing. I'm about to, I'm about to build what they refer to as a switchback. Oh, you just did a little shoe repair. Why wouldn't you just buy a new pair of shoes, man? Some shoes just aren't worth putting in the effort to repair them, you know what I mean? Okay, clean this out just a bit. There we go. Okay, so they're less than a year old. Unfortunately, that happens. Okay, I think I've got this carved out wide enough that I can start performing my switch back here. Yeah, all right, good. Well, I guess it really depends on where in the heck did you purchase them in the first place, you know what I mean? Oh, they're New Balance. So well, that's not so bad, but it's very unusual that they've already, uh, you've already had to do a little bit of a soul repair on them like that. Man, what the hell happened to New Balance and their frickin'... Okay, there we go. Yes, yes, there we go. Switch back complete, chat. I'm hard on shoes too, but shit. Mind you, I'll never, after, after my last experience with Pumas, I'll never buy another pair of fucking Pumas ever again. Holy shit. I know I'm hard on shoes, but shoes shouldn't explode after like fucking six months. Come on, baby. Come on, come on, come on. Look, we're right there. We are right there. I can't even climb this, It's but we're almost there. Come on. Come on. Baby. Ooh. There we go. All right, switch back complete. Oh shit. Oh, you know what? No, I should no, we should be all right. Okay. Should be all right. Oh, I'm definitely going to take that corn. Let's go. What's in here? Place I want to turn. Give me your, give me your life. Man, I'm not getting wolf me shit. Ripped off. Ripped off, man. Uh, shit. Whoa, bees, fucking bees, man. Had to be goddamn bees, didn't it? Didn't it? Yeah, had to be the goddamn. Oh! Ah, oh, 
mother fucker. Mother trucker. All right. We're going back. I'm getting my stuff. I ain't leaving my stuff on the side of no goddamn hill. Ain't happening. Not gonna happen. No freaking way. Not happening. Uh, but we are definitely gonna have to do no, that. And grab us some of that. Okay. And before I forget, we're going to throw down with a bandage. There we go. All right. Boom shakalaka. <laughs> that, what? What got clipped? Me dying? To the freaking bees? God damn bees. It's always the bees in video games, chat. Always the bees. Bees always gonna mess with you. All right, there we go. Uh, um, okay, so where's, uh, right there on the side. You know what? That's fine. You know why? You know why that's fine now? Because I can do this. Because dad can do this. Uh, let's, let's, whoa, 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 whoa. Easy does it, bud. It's the stamina thing all over again. Take all of it. It's all mine anyway. Fuck. God damn it. Actually, you know what? No, this this is fine. We can do this. Whoa, not if I do it that way, we're not. Well, that's gonna be bad. Sheesh. Oop, hop. Where am I digging to? China. I'm digging through the planet. <laughs> I want my new flight equipment. The only way to do that is to dig straight through to China. Direct route. So there's a, a waypoint, as you guys can see on the on the map up at the top. That's the point that I'm trying to get to. Unfortunately, I keep dying. <laughs> I ordered authentic takeout. Factually correct. Oh, speaking of takeout, so last night for dinner, um, so I was over at Zool's. Uh, we were getting her uh, her office, her workspace sort of set up a little bit better, uh, make it a little more conducive for her to use um, instead of what she had. Uh, we ended up having, uh, there's a place locally called Burrito Guys. Um, not that expensive apparently, and it was freaking really good. I was really impressed with it. Authentic, authentic Mexican food, by the way. Very, very well done. Very impressed with it. Uh, and wasn't very expensive. It was actually very, uh, very reasonably priced. And the burrito was like fucking that big around. It was huge. It was just fat. 
big old fat bro. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoo, that was almost bad. <laughs> oh, shit. <gasps> oh, no. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, chat. Dad's in trouble. Dad's in trouble. Chat, dad's in trouble. Well, this wasn't a hole in the wall. This place is actually brand new in town. They only just recently opened, but... Uh-oh. Actually, you know what? No, that's fine. I think... Oh my god, my ankles. Holy crap. I don't want to do that too many times. Holy sh... Well... Okay, you know what? We survived at that time. There it is. There it is. Aha! I found what we came for. Flame altar. Hello, sir. Flame shrine. Collect. That's right. Give me your stuff. Bone meal. Okay. Gladly take that. Yeah. Oop. Ooh, resin. Those are books. Don't care about the books. Alright, uh, what else do we have down here that... Oh, nope, that's the edge of the game world. Okay. Well, we found the edge of the map, chat. We found the edge of the map. Yes, yes we did. And I can't see diddly squat now. Holy crap. Uh, there we go. Oh, that's better. Okay. Well, we found the edge. <laughs> I mean... Okay, so that's the edge. All right, so that's... The boundary right there. So we found this edge here. Flame shrine. Okay. I mean, I will take the lean raw meat. Yes, please. That's fantastic. Look at all the fireflies around here. Shit, that hurt. Oh my god. Holy shit, what the hell was this dude? Alright, all that bullshit and that's all I got from you? Man. Weak. Uh, we are not messing around. By the way, the one thing you never do, never mess around in the shroud in the dark. Never mess around with the shroud in the dark chat. Bad things happen to good people. Okay, yeah, we're, we're using the healing. I'm... Um, uh, uh, I'm making the judgment call, okay? Oh, shit! Man's is... No, I am not giving you a line on me, you son of a bitch. Correct, nerd. All right, having having some range is uh, yeah, exactly. The fireflies aren't trying to kill me. Thank God for small miracles, right?
Uh, well... <sighs> I've done about all the exploration I'm comfortable with down here. Oh shit, there's so many of them down. What the fracking? Ow! Listen here, you son of a bitch. Holy hell. Well, I mean, we're getting some kills at least, but still. Uh, that doesn't look healthy down there. That does not look... Wow. Uh, I don't know if we... You know what? I'm not really ready to go down there, chat. No. I don't think we need to go down there. At least not right yet. Hell no. Nope. Mm -mm. Sure don't. Sure don't need to go down there. Yeah, fireflies are nice and friendly. We don't have to worry about fireflies trying to, you know, remove our face or anything, you know? Oh, sure don't need to go down there. Oh, look, more scumbags. How are you doing, scumbags? Oh, shit. Woo! I mean, you can chase me. I'm all right with that. Can we do... Ow! You son of a bitch! Woo! Jesus Christ! All right, here we go. Finally. Holy hell. Start using the bow a little bit more. I mean, it's not necessarily a whole bunch of fuck no. Um, I mean, there's definitely a lot going on down here. A lot more. Oh my lord. Dead. Whew. Shield. Oh, I'm totally picking. I'm totally checking that out. Oh, oh shit. Ow. Okay, that hurt. Mother trucker. Shield, huh? That is a rough looking shield. Holy crap, that is rough looking. Good God. Okay, well, we've got another spark. All right, you know what? Um, let's do this. Sleep. Uh, nope, this one, right, okay, we've got that, got that, um,
We're going to delete that because that's terrible. And I'm going to do that over there. Okay, we don't need any stone for a little bit. More than enough stone. Uh, What do I... What? Hmm. All right, Canadian Gamer, cheers, man. Thanks for being here. Huh. Oh, God, that's... No, we're getting rid of that. That oh, I should have salvaged that. Oop. Oh, well, too late. Mistakes were made. Mistakes were made. Okay, so this is what we're going to do. Uh, we're going to go to that and we're going to go to seven. Okay. I'm going to start cooking up some goodies here. Because we need them tender vittles. All right. Oh, God damn it. Yo, Dave, how are you? I mean, I'm still here working my digital street corner, so you tell me. How's tricks? I haven't won the lottery, so you know. Oh, damn it. So you tell me. I'm, I'm Listen, I'm still working my digital street corner. That's how it is. That's how it be. I'm still sitting here hooking myself out. Okay, that and there. All right. How you doing, Dave? Okay, so <sighs> do yeah. Uh, you know what? I don't think I'm going back for my tombstone. I don't think I'm doing that. Nope. No, sir. Don't think so. We've already been to the ancient obelisk. Been to Woodguard. Got that wood shrine. Uh, so we need to be able to forge a weapon, huh? Shit. Story of Rot. Hmm. Actually, you know what? I think, chat. After you pop, I, hey, I didn't do shit. It wasn't me. I'm in Canada. There's no way a Canadian busted your power grid. That's on you. That that is that is on you and the British people. That is not you. Cannot put that on a Canadian. There is no way. It is virtually impossible for me to do that. Possible. I'm glad that you got your power back, though. Glad you got your power back. But anyway, chat. Um, that is actually, I think that is going to be it for me for today. I'm going to wrap it up here. We're going to return back to the main menu. I'm going to quit out. Thanks for hanging out with me today. Uh, by the way, just so you are all aware... We are still going to be playing Valheim on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Okay, so Valheim is, they said, no, nah, listen, I don't do shit like that. I am a respectable freaking law abiding citizen. I ain't got no time for none of that kind of bullshit ain't happening. Anyway, um, chat. So tomorrow we're back into Valheim. We're picking up where we left off. Uh, it's uh, building up the gear to go and run bone mass. So we've already got two, two of the Forsaken down. We've got Ike there. We've got the Elder taken down. Uh, we're going to be building up and working our way towards doing bone mass. Uh, I already know where the swamp is. So the nice thing is I'm going to be able to get in there. We've got the key. I can do some of the, we can do some of the crypts, get some of the black iron and uh, start on crafting some iron gear to get us further, you know, progress ourselves further through. So chat, thank you for hanging out with me. I appreciate the hell out of you. Thank you for spending your Monday here. I will catch you all back here tomorrow for Valhimmel.
modded, heavily modded Valheim, by the way. Uh, love your faces. Thank you for the follows. Thanks for the subs. The resubs, the gifted subs, the bits and the tips. Thanks for all the support over the last almost eight years now. You guys are awesome. I love your faces. Have a wonderful Monday night, everyone. Cheers.